Have you ever wondered what dexmedetomidine or Presidex is? It's a medication often employed for sedation during medical procedures. Its use is indicated for intensive care unit sedation and procedural sedation. Now you might ask, why is Presidex preferred over other sedatives? Dexmedetomidine works in a unique way. It's a bit like a secret agent, acting as an agonist of alpha-2 adrenergic receptors in the brain. This means it binds to these receptors, causing a chain reaction that reduces nerve signals to the heart and blood vessels. As a result, blood pressure and heart rate decrease, creating a calming effect. It's like turning down the volume on a loudspeaker, bringing tranquility to the body. But, what are the other options for sedation? There are other sedatives available but Presidex has certain advantages. Consider the alternatives Propofol and Midazolam. While they can induce sedation, they often lead to a deeper level of unconsciousness than desired. Presidex on the other hand, provides a unique form of sedation. It allows patients to attain a calm state while maintaining a certain level of cooperativeness or consciousness. This makes it easier for medical personnel to communicate with patients during procedures however like all medications Presidex does have side effects. Although effective, Presidex isn't without its potential side effects. Like many medications, dexmedetomidine or Presidex can cause a few adverse effects. Some of these may include a dry mouth, lowered blood pressure, and a reduced heart rate. It's critical that these potential side effects are not overlooked or dismissed. Always engage in a thorough discussion with your healthcare provider about any potential risks or adverse effects before starting any new medication. It's not just about knowing your medication but understanding it. So there you have it. A brief but comprehensive look at dexmedetomidine or Presidex. Remember, understanding your medications is an important step towards better health.